Today we are going to discuss the Han coat of arms. But before we get started, we'd like to let you know that we offer genealogy research service at our website. Please visit us at coadb.com. First coat of arms to discuss belonged to the Han family of Latvia and Estonia and Lithuania, or the Baltics. It says here the House of Han is an ancient German Baltic noble family, prominent in the Duchy of Courland and on the Baltic island of Ocel. It's founded in 1230, and one member of the family was Baron Paul Theodor von Hahn. Born 1793, a privy councillor, civil governor of Courland and Livland, senator and imperial state councillor, and an honorary member of the Russian Academy of Sciences. Similar coat of arms, this one with, a, with supporters for Friedrich von Hahn, born 1742, a German landowner and astronomer who descended from a Mecklenburg aristocratic family. He was hereditary lord of Remplin and Knight of the Danenbrog Order. He was elevated to the status of Count on September 7th, 1802. Here we see Castle Remplin. Next, uh, Pomerania and Mecklenburg, Frederick Leopold von Hahn, 11 years 1760, said to be Chief Forest Officer and Chamberlain. Hahn of Estonia, there was August Wilhelm von Hahn, he had his nobility confirmed in 1864 and was son of Major Ernst von Hahn, who was ennobled in Russia in 1786 and is said to have come from Switzerland, the son of Michael Hahn, who acquired the manor of Lechveri, who was grandson of Ernest Hahn, born 1621, who migrated to Tallinn, Estonia in 1650, who was the son of Jakob Hahn, who received the manor of Asrovo, from the King of Sweden in 1630. And ultimately, he was the son of Jakob Hahn, who lived in Rostock and died in the year 1597. Another for Hahn of Saxony, the crest having a, it looks like roses in it. I wasn't able to find any additional information on this one. And here we have Johann August von Hahn who died in 1799. He was a privy counselor to Empress Catherine II of Russia, and he was general director of the St. Petersburg Post Department and Imperial Postmaster. And it looks like the descendants of Johann received... So Johann August were also received in the St. Petersburg nobility with the Russian arms grant in 1791. And then there's some other members listed, listed below. This is for Han of Austria. Coat of arms of Karl Friedrich Hahn, the first chancellor and canon of Hereford Abbey, ennobled in 1729. Han of Westphalia. Coat of arms and crest of Johann Casimir Hahn, who was ennobled on March 4th, 1767 in Bavaria. He was a court chamber counselor and secretary of the Order of St. Michael. And he had son Max Joseph von Hahn. We have the coat of arms, crest and supporters for Karl Ludwig Hahn, a captain in our artillery corps. He was ennobled in Prussia on May 17th, 1806. Here we have Otto Conrad Hahn, a member of the Royal Prussian Chamber Council. He was, or this was granted on December 6th, 1788. We have Hahn of Frankfurt am Main in Germany. Hahn of Hesse in Germany. An individual who was ennobled on April 18th, 1821. Han of Holland. Han of Bern, Switzerland. Family active there since 1538. One later member was Amadeus Emanuel Han, 
born 1801, who we see here, a Swiss officer and one of the most distinguished Bill Hellens, both during the Greek Revolution of 1821 and later during the first years of the existence of the new Greek state. Coat of arms of Han von Reichenberg in Switzerland. One member of this family was Maria Frederica Hahn, who died in 1901. She was a teacher at a nursing institution. Uh, Han von Lach from Switzerland. Johann Gottfried von Hahn, born 1694. He was ennobled 1748. He was a doctor of philosophy and medicine, a landowner in Silesia, privy counselor in Prussia, and the son of Dr. Sigmund Hahn in Schwednitz. Here we see Johann and I believe his father. Then we have Han D. Klitzink of Misny, Han von Munster from Switzerland, Jorg Marcus Hahn, counselor, ennobled as von Konigsberg on July 26, 1693, Han von Bern, Switzerland. This one, the has a key in it. Hermann Jakob Hahn, Master of Philosophy and Bachelor of Theology, who uh, lived in Dresden and was murdered in his own home in 1726. Hahn of Rhineland, family that traces back to the 1600s. First generations were schoolmasters. Johann Peter Hahn Baker moved to Obsteren. Uh, his descendants were bakers, brewers, and hotel owners. And it looks like the brothers Max Hahn and Alfred Hahn were given a coat of arms by King Charles Looks like they, okay, have a coat of arms with King Charles VI granted in 1729 to the first chancellor and canon of Hereford Abbey. So it looks like they were entitled to bear that coat of arms, perhaps. But this is different than that one that we discussed. Hmm. Solomon Hahn, born in the year, I'm sorry, live in the year 1704, deputy judge in Marienburg. Hahn von Bopfingen, or is Heinrich Hahn and Hans Hahn, who lived in the 14th century. Han of Livonia, or Latvia. One member of this family was Kirsten Han, alive in the year 1523. Another, we don't have any information on this one. This one was someone who was knighted by Carl Theodore in 1767. This one was born by some Prussian army officers who died in the 19th and 18th centuries. And lastly, Marcus Philip von Hahn, counselor in Würzburg, had son Franz Joseph Hahn, born 1699, Bishop of Arad, and later Marx Hahn von Konigsberg was ennobled in 1793. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com, link in the description. Thank you very much.